Hello everyone, Super GT here. I'm going to be taking a look at the new Lewis Hamilton DLC in Gran Turismo Sport. I've not touched it yet, I haven't seen what it's about. So we're going to jump in, I've been told it's in campaign, there it is, so you just jump down to the bottom here. The time trial challenge. So, the man himself has set some times on the game and well, here are the, here are the tracks that he's done it on. In the Mercedes GT3 car, Apart from, oh yeah, apart from this one. I did see this during the presentation he made. Uh, the Sauber C9 at Nürburgring, which is probably a very crazy combination. Uh, let's take a look. So we've got Dragon Trail Seaside, uh, Maggiore, Franz Hatch, Willow Spring, Suzuka, uh, Monza, Mount Panorama, Interlagos, Nürburgring, and then Life. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with Nürburgring because that's for me my best circuit. I'll probably have the highest chance of trying to actually beat him. So let's let's jump into let's jump into this. It's a 156.5 for gold, but let's try and get his 155.3. Gotta be nice and smooth. He was really smooth on his lap. I, I'd like to know how many laps he did to try to get this lap time. In fact, I've got traction control on here. Turn that off. It's not gonna help. So Lewis Hamilton was actually uh, using the chase cam in uh, at least the exhibition race that we did together. So it's quite an interesting um, approach. Not too many people were using the chase cam in, in these uh, live events. But Hamilton is a fan of the chase cam. Obviously it's, it's working for him here because he's bloody flying away from me. Look at him, he's miles ahead. One and a half seconds ahead at this point. So it's going to take me more than a few laps. I think it's going to be a little bit harder than the circuit experience where you normally can get a gold first lap. This is not going to be as easy as that. It certainly is not. So I think if that ghost gets a little bit further ahead, I'm going to lose track of it completely. So I've lost another tenth of a second or more than through the Schumacher S. Into the next chicane just see if I can get that delta down a little bit from here to the end of the lap. We saw that he didn't take too much curb on the final chicane. So again, I'm just using it. It's like I'm using a tenth for every chicane. Or a tiny bit more. Let's see if I can gain some tenths through this one. By taking plenty of the curb all over it. Um, I've probably kept it about even there. But I wasn't very clean. Okay, so that is a, quite a horrifying effort. Two seconds slower. So that's going to take quite a long time to beat. I didn't even get the gold time. That's a great time. He tells me it's a great time, but I, I don't think it was. Um, we'll go again. Let's see if we can beat him on our second try. 57.3. So I need to get eight tenths quicker to get even the gold time. So. Getting gold is quite hard, and then beating Hamilton is even harder. So we'll go again. We'll try once more. See if we can beat Lewis Hamilton, now the six-time Formula One world champion, of course. Gotta be gentle on those brakes. He take, carries so much speed in, look at that. It would be interesting to see Lewis in a GT3 car, actually. But for now, he's got his heart set on Formula One. Probably going to try and beat Michael Schumacher's records. And again, just on the exit, he gets really good exit speed. So he's already six tenths of a second ahead. Just got to keep it nice and close. He just keeps his mid corner speed up so much. He's really good at that. Maybe I'm not on the throttle early enough through the middle of the corner, that is the problem. But he's really, really committed there. So already pulling away a second ahead through the Schumacher S. Can I put anything back through here? A little bit of gravel, that's not going to help. And I can use a little bit more on the entry here to get a better angle. Again, too, little, too, de uh, too deep on the brakes. It's actually just costing me time. I'm trying too hard to beat him. That gap is going to 
Where's my other ghost? My ghost is just there. We might get a gold. Might. Actually, I probably won't. Unless I really get this dead right. So I did catch there a little bit. Got down to 1.3, but it's not going to be enough for gold, I don't think. So these times are pretty good. You know, Lewis Hamilton hasn't held back here. Uh, so even some of the best players will take time to beat these laps. Okay, so I completely failed at Nürburgring, which is my best track. So I'm not sure how I'm going to do another track. We'll try another track. Let's see. Um, let's see the list again. Okay, so I guess it's got to be a track that Hamilton doesn't do too much or doesn't do in real life. Because of course, some of these are in F1. He'd, he'd know those very well. Suzuka, Monza, Interlagos, Nürburgring. So he'd probably struggle around one of these ones, I reckon. So I'm gonna go, let's go for Dragon Trail Seaside. It's got the death chicane. I'm assuming Hamilton didn't get killed by the death chicane, but we'll see if we can beat him around here. Right, we're going to jump straight in, see if we can beat him. Big rolling start here. So you only get one lap, it's not like you can just keep lapping and lapping, you just do one lap and then that's it. So you get the same speed over the start line, so it's a fair start. And he's, uh, he's already, look at that, he's already beating me. I do have traction control on though, so turn that off. Oh god, that's not how you want to do it. I'm a bit closer though, compared to how I was at Nürburgring. Half a second at this point. Let's see how he deals with the triple chicane then. Oh, it feels like I'm understeering so much. I'm not getting on the power at the right time. And he gains on me again. Maybe Lewis Hamilton should start competing there in the uh, FIA Championship on Gran Turismo, try and qualify for these World Finals. By the looks of it, he's pretty quick. Okay, 1.5 seconds down, this isn't going well. My YouTube career is over. Oh, God. I think Nico Rosberg's gonna have to do the easy career over. Because by the looks of it, Hamilton is massively overshadowing me here and making me look very stupid. Final corner. 1.8 seconds down, okay. So these challenges are hard. Um, they're not going to be ones you can do first time, I don't think. 38.8, again, That's a not even time. a gold. Across the line, and it's not a gold. A silver, a silver again, he's told me it's a good lap, but I'm not happy. I haven't been able to beat him, and I haven't been able to get the gold time even. So, on this occasion, I've been defeated twice by Hamilton, unfortunately. But that is just a quick look at the Lewis Hamilton DLC on Gran Turismo Sport. A really good challenge, a really tough challenge, and one that I'm sure that a lot of people will be spending a lot of time on trying to beat him. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe for plenty more content. But also in the comments section, do let me know your times on the Dragon Trail circuit and on Nürburgring GP. Could you beat me? Could you beat Gold? Could you beat Lewis Hamilton? Comment down below and let us know. But apart from that, thank you so much for watching and we shall see you next time.